My wheat's still hanging in there. Hang in there a little longer, wheat. It is 3 a.m. Let's sleep till dawn. <laughs> In the family tab along the bottom, click on the tiny oil icon. Oh my god. That that wasn't obvious at all. How would they do why would they do that to me? Oh, shoot. Get off. Equip hammer to move furniture. Oh. Thank you for all the pro tips. You're you're saving me a lot of Google time. All right, get wrecked. You get wrecked. You too. Game still needs some fine tuning. It does. I mean, they still do really, really well. All right. Put the chair over here. Put, uh, let's see. And put the table over here. The crafting bench. Close to here. Oop. And now, oh, come on, there's space. That looks terrible. Okay. Get that hammer back out. I'm gonna swap these places. No? Alright. I wreck you. Crafting bench. I guess I'll put the table in front of the hearth. I don't know, none of this feels very feng shui to me. First of all, who has a cabinet that close to their bed? And now this table seems way too close. There we go. This is about as nice as my house can look, I think. Let's R to rotate a furniture item. Neat. Someone, someone put a crafting table outside. That would make things a lot better. Oh, I love it. Boop. This all looks much, much better. Alright. Now, if I had smallpox, surely I can't get smallpox immediately again, right? You sold most of your furniture and clothing gifts? That's fair. I like to think of them as like an emergency fund. Like if I can't afford dysentery medicine or something. Like, yeah, sell the table. So in a weird way, like, furniture is kind of like the bank to me. You want a bed? I'll bet you do. Oh, good morning, daughter. I think I would get sick again. I wouldn't think so. How long do I have before this bouquet rots? It never does. So let's check on Rose. The fish sack his shack is locked. I, I'm concerned. Is everybody dead? Local iron closed. Everything does seem to be closed. Hmm. 
Ooh, grapes. Two days until they rot. I guess while we wait for the town to wake up, we get all our golden stuff down to limbo. It'll be nice to be done with golden stuff. Oh, hi, kitty. Yeah, come on over. Everybody's here. You don't have many days left of school, daughter. Nope. You're sad about that? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I am sad for you. You want to stay in your teacher's class? Yeah. She was a good teacher. You, it was the same kindergarten teacher your brother had. And I always thought she was super nice. I'm in the death water. That is correct. Those are ghosts. Yeah. We're going to talk to him. How's life been treating me? Good, good. How's death been treating you? You want cooking oil? Or the down you go recipe? They really want to give me that down you go recipe. Krista Chavez. Been a while since I've spoken to a living, breathing human. You want beer. Reasonable. Yeah. Don't do it. Why not? It would be bad for a ghost. You think beer would be bad for the ghost? Yeah, because it would go right through them. Oh, okay. So you think it would be a waste of beer. Maybe that's what they're trying to find out. Alright, let's teleport to town. Boop. How's it going, buddy? For me, wood beams are like a blank canvas. Okay. Do you have anything cool? You really don't. Yes. Um, yes. He did have a bed. And somebody wanted a bed. Isabella wanted a bed. Who is he? Her. And she would give me lots of milk for it. Okay. You'd, you'd do it? Yeah. Hey you, sell me a bed. Get back here. Oh, uh, the girl with smallpox? That's the one that wants the bed. Oh, but he doesn't sell bad beds. He only sells good beds. Hey, Isabella, how you doing? Looking clean, young man, sugar. How can I help you? It's no place like home, but the Sleeping Siren Inn is the next best place. I grew up playing the piano. I think it's a lot of fun. Some people have trouble with it, though. I think I <laughs> Let's give her a rose. Oh, I couldn't be happier. Thank you. I had to catch up. Bye. Yeah, she's got smallpox. The whole town has smallpox. I had smallpox. But I did fine. We're all good. Yeah, do we shake the roses? Yeah. Oh, can we shake the house for the roses? No. Yeah, I think. Howdy. I'd like to share a story with you, but I don't think you'd ever believe me. 
Go for it. Dragon fruit cake will never let me down. You're right, I don't believe it. Benjamin gets excited about the littlest things. Kids, eh? Here, how about you have a rose? This isn't bad, young man, Sugarheart. This isn't bad at all. Bye. I mean, I got a lot of roses. I should just give them all away for free. I, oh, I already gave one to Isabella, but I can only give her one. Well, think of it. What if you somebody gave you a rose? You'd love it, right? What if they kept giving you roses? Just rose after rose after rose. Just piles and piles of roses. We'll plant them. You'd plant them? In dirt. In dirt. Probably a good plan. Howdy. I would like to sell you everything in the world. Grapes, lavenders, whatever those are. Your own roses. I'll save a couple for gifts. Have a silver crawfish. These grapes don't have much life left in them. Yeah, you know, I have them all. I'll find more. Give me your money. Anything else? Nope, that's it. I'm gonna let go and then get up the stairs. What's going on in here? Yeah, what's going on in here? Everybody seems to be doing fine. He, he's spell I can go. Well, she is sick. She really should be staying home. I haven't seen the blacksmith in days. Wake up, blacksmith. I go in their bed next time. I can't go in their bed. You can't just go into other people's beds. Oof. Maybe all the smithies are sick. I think they might be. What about the little but I can't harvest my wheat until I repair my sickle. Yep, and that's the alarm telling me I gotta get you kids to school. Oh, thank you. We are kind of at an impasse, I think. Do I have enough fish to drive fish? I do. Daddy. It is so hard to do things when everybody in town has the plague. What do we do? I think we go home and call it a day, and we will play next week. I'm thinking Monday. I think Monday would be a good time to play this game again. Ooh, grapes. Grapes. There we go. Give it. Give it. Grab the flowers, Dad. Yeah, I'll grab those too. It'll be good. I mean, everybody seems to be enjoying Plum Grove, including myself, so I think next week we're gonna play it three times. I think we're actually gonna take Octopath Traveler off the menu for a little while. We're gonna be playing Hades, Elden Ring, and Echoes of Plum Grove. And it should be a good time. Paper. Toilet paper? That's not toilet paper, that's cloth. Like. Don't use my cloth as toilet paper. 
<laughs> I'm really. You gonna wipe your butt on my cloth? Yeah. <laughs> well, then I'll make you a hat with it. Take a shower. You'll put it on me and then take a shower. Yeah, fair. Fair. Alright. We go to sleep. Higher chance of silver and gold. Artisan goods. Recipes learned. Iron lantern post. Sounds nice. Alright. Oh. Let's not starve to death. Let us eat fish. Nom 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 nom. Why did you feel like... Uh, because I was hungry. Now that I don't have smallpox, I can, like, just starve for, a, you know, a little bit. No, don't, don't. Okay. Good night, everybody. I had a great time today. Uh, it'll be fun when we play this on Monday and discover half the village just died. Uh, stick around and we will find somebody to raid. It'll be great. Have fun. Wherever you are. Have fun wherever you are. Alright, who do we raid? Oh, my cat's meowing for you. Hey, meow. <laughs>